guys, welcome to the special episode of The Chris Show. It is episode 10 of The Chris Show, season 1. Everyone, let's hear a round of applause. Come on, I'll clap along with you. Okay. Well, I used to have an app on my old iPod called One Clap. Clap. Between speeds of clapping. I record a minute ten one day. Yeah. I'm sure you have my airport. So here's my seat. I'll be sitting on it. Today, special seat. Every ten episodes we tend to do a special question. So yeah. So um I'm gonna do a random segment today. Um so with this book, I'm going to spot out books. If a book is too hard for you, well, I learned this in library class. Check if a book is too hard for you or too easy for you. You have to get a book, open up to maybe halfway of the book, and read one page. And if there's one word you don't know, it's too easy. Zero words you don't know, it's too easy. Two words you don't you don't know, it could be a little, sorry, <clears throat> it could be a little more challenging, but, and three is, you know, challenging yourself, so, okay. Dear Dom Diary, Mrs. Evans had to remind us again that our fairy tale report is due in a couple of weeks, then we read a few more fairy tales and talked about them. We started with the princess and the pea, which is probably the most exciting and thrilling story ever written about someone having mild insomnia. I do not want to know what that is, but I'll search it up later because I've seen it in a lot of stuff. I said that it teaches you, teaches you a lot about, wait, wait, I said that it teaches you, wait, teaches us that you probably don't want to sleep in a bed that someone had peed. See, I think this one's spelling a pee, but if I don't know what it is, I'll search it up on my computer, but it's two words. I don't know what a seizure is. Well, that was something. So. Oh. Okay. I'll search up what it is on my computer. Okay, right now I'm off the chair, but, you know, I'll just lay on it because I want to. Okay, what is it? Insomnia? Okay, insomnia is a, um, is trouble falling asleep or staying asleep through the night. Okay, I kind of have that. Anyways. Peed, P A P E D. Um, they just spelled peed wrong. Wait, let me see if I can get a definition. Peed is, I don't really know what it's initial or something. You know, go okay. ahead. Now we are going to go to our main segment. But first, I'm gonna do one more book for you guys. Let me just get it on my. Oh. Okay. Nerd camp. This one. Freddy. So, yeah. I read that. The one. That one, too. So, yeah. Okay. This one. Nerd camp. So, we're in a page. The questioning took place the next day during free time. They all met at the picnic table in the woods. Anyone who came by chasing a frisbee or looking for a quiet place to read apologized and ran off, since it was clear that the meeting was official. The suspect wore a bathing suit between her tank top and shorts. At Amanda's suggestion, Jenny refused to talk without legal counsel present, so she was joined by Amanda, who looked the part in a big t-shirt with her name of her father, father's law firm on the pocket. Both girls had their hair tied into two French braids beneath bandanas, Jenny's red and Amanda's tie-dyed. On the other 
Outside of the table, the detectives all wore shorts and t-shirts. Coleman, that's a name so it doesn't count, sat in the middle wearing a New York Mets hat. The sham police, oh, sham police officers sat on each other. Okay. The chief was wearing a khaki fisherman's hat that said fan family blah 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 and a gavel. A gavel. So I said something about a gavel, so I just said blah blah because we're in the town. So yeah. Okay. Let me search what the gavel is. Let's get Oh, like a mouth thing when you're quick. so well I don't know what the other words were so yeah I really forget the page I'm on so yeah anyways this is the main segment I've been waiting to tell you about okay I'm gonna put my computer in front oh guys computer in front of you Oh, yeah. okay. This is my company um that I have. It's called Shimmering Bracelets. Okay, as you can see up there. I will read to you what it says in the box. If you want to go on the website, you can to follow along with me. It says, Hi, we are a company called Shimmering Bracelets. We sell bracelets and corner bookmarks. You may may buy them. Please contact us first and we will process your order. Smiley face. Our info will be in the more section on about us. So, ugh, my computer. Whenever I like move it, there's like a rubber thing on the bottom. Like big squeaking. So. Okay. Anyways. Let's bring things. News. Our news is... Hi, we are a new company. This is our website. We sell bracelets and corner bookmarks. Please go in the more section and go on about us. You may contact us and then say your order. For example, you can request a braided bracelet with orders of light green, red, and orange. And the order will be processed. You will then have to state your information, which is how we can contact you for our, your order. Please state your email. That is pretty much it. You can state more information to contact us. I have this, my, this company with my sister and my friend. And the bog entry was by Chris the Cone. <sighs> Slash web designer. Okay. We made the website on the 21st. We have this company since fall 2012. Um, the spring sale, we also, that's where we have. Spring sale lasts from the 22nd of April to the um, 21st of May. So, yep. Okay. The members we only have are the site owner, which is Shimmering underscore bracelets. And I don't know why it says, yep, that. Um, the forms we have so far, we have three forms. I did my last form 23 minutes ago, so. Okay, I'll tell you it from the first form, um, which 44 hours ago, to what I just did. So it's, hey people, this is our new company. It is owned by the two Olivia's and Chris, which is me. This is a great company. We sell bracelets, all types, and corner bookmarks. Great things to come with this company. And there with that. Ah. The mouse is not working right now, so now it is. Okay, back to the other one. General discussion. Okay. And rules for our company. I must read. We have some rules for our company. The rules for the company is if you want a custom bracelet, you will be charged 10 cents to a dollar more depending on the type of bracelet. For example, for a twist, you will be charged 10 cents more. For a braid, you will be charged 25 cents more. You will be charged 50 cents more for a custom double chain knot bracelet. You will be charged 75 cents to a dollar more depending on how many strings there is. Thank you for reading this. By Chris, the web designer and co-owner. Okay. Then, I wrote this 25 minutes ago. 
our sales so far in the Shimmering Bracelet Fund. The sales for our company so far have been great. We have sold many bracelets and corner bookmarks. Please keep buying and supporting our company because some of the sales go to the highlighted Shimmering Bracelets Fund. The Shimmering Bracelet Fund is a fund where we save money of most of our orders and put it in the jar. Once we get $30 in the jar, we will buy more supplies so we can make bracelets for you non-stop. Thank you for supporting us in this journey to get our company goes. And down here, I underlined it by Christopher, the web designer and one of the owners. And it's shimmering bracelets under here, smiley face, smiley face, and right here, smiley face is all over our entries. There's been three posts since the 21st of April. Okay, more, our photo color. We have no photos on it because I didn't know how to do that. The videos, um, I think I'm going to do that later. Like, I'll do that on the weekends and about us. Final page, our info. Here's our info to contact us. Our key is Shimmering Bracelet. You can follow us on that. That's S-H-I-M-M-E-R-I-N-G-B-R-A-C-E-L-E-T. Our Instagram is Shimmering underscore Bracelet, which is S-H-I-M-M-E-R-I-N-G underscore bracelet, B-R-A-C-E-L-A-T. And our email, if you want to contact us for an order, a custom order, is shimmering, S-H-I-M-M-E-R-I-N-G underscore bracelets, B-R-A-C-E-L-E-T-S at AOL, AOL, which is A-O-L, so, no, dot com. Dot C O F. Okay. And that's pretty much it for the website. We have, we have it. Nightly. It's on it. So, yeah, pretty much. Time for shout outs. On this one, I'll be giving an email shout out to my company also. So, follow these users. Or, you can follow the email, but. Follow and subscribe on Keek at Shimmering Bracelet. The Instagram is Shimmering underscore Bracelet. And the email, if you want to contact us, is Shimmering underscore Bracelet at AOL.com. Okay, time for other people. Shout out. Follow Chris1159 on Instagram, which is me. And subscribe and follow to um my Keek, which is Chris1159. Um, yeah, I think I just do those, right? Yeah, I don't have anything else. Yeah, Instagram, keep okay. Um, okay, and then follow to and subscribe on Olivia, my sister's kick. It's, um, boutique, B-O-W-T-I-Q-U-E-E-E, -E -E, and that's our Instagram also. Instagram is B-O-W-T-I-Q-U-E-E-E. -E -E. Also, follow my, I mean, my friend's Instagram, Nevas, N-E-V-A, underscore, stop, underscore, dancing, follow them on Instagram, and their keek is Shimmering Dancer, which is like the shimmering I told you in Shimmering Bracelets, and the word dancer. Okay, then... Um, follow, um, NerdGab291. Oh, I forgot YouTube. Oh, we'll do those later. Um, well, okay, and now I'll do the, those YouTube. Mine singing lover 1059. Follow, I mean, subscribe. Subscribe to Livy. I mean, not, not Olivia, my sister. Olivia, my sister's is The Scary Pillow. And then subscribe to Livy June 24. L I V I June 24. Also, subscribe to NerdGab291 on YouTube. And her Instagram is private and she doesn't have a key. Also, follow Raya Loves Ya 421 on Instagram. And uh, subscribe. Well, she doesn't use key anymore and her youtube is mariah raya 89 and also a grande over here grande cow you must follow is grande flower big shout out bye guys and that was a quick show 15 minutes